Hello, 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 and welcome back to Bummy Budgets. We are now in the month of May, guys, officially. We are going to be cash stuffing for May week number one. We are going to be stuffing a total of $465. Let's get started. Let's go ahead and sort out all of our cash. Use this citrine. Hopefully, we can manifest some more money in the month of May. Let's get that. Let's get the money. Okay. Put this here. So we should have $465. So let's count it out. One, two, three, 350, 370, 390, uh, 400, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. So 450. 451, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, and 65. So 465, guys. Okay. I feel like that was long-winded, but we got through it. So $465 there. I would say pretty much all of this money is, mm, it is not top notch, guys. Not looking cute this week. We barely have any crispy anything. All of it's not looking cute. <laughs> pretty chunky. Okay. Now we are sorted. And so obviously i have some new nails on for this month so these are going to be my nails for may very cute fun i've never done like clear kind of style i usually don't like clear style um nails just because you can see really like the when it gets like over like overgrowth and whatnot yeah i don't like that so we'll see how it goes this is my first time also the lotion of the week is my hemp's sweet pineapple and honey melon this is a travel size one one to just throw in your purse and whatnot let's go ahead and put a glob of that there and a glob of that here i love the original one i will say this one's very very sweet it is nourishing um i wouldn't call it i would say it's more like high-end drugstore it's drugstore and they also sell it at Ulta too. Ulta carries quite a like bunch of different scents from them but the original I still think is the best. So yeah very nourishing. It sinks pretty quickly into the skin. Uh, I wouldn't say it necessarily has an oily residue or a sticky residue at all. Yeah sinks in quite well. Also my bobble for the week is, you guys have seen this before, it's just my purple cute little ring. I love it, so I don't know. And then my wallet for this month is this baby blue uh, wallet. So let's go ahead and start get started with our cash envelopes. I went ahead and switched out the cash envelopes just because I am using a different wallet. And okay. I also need to get rid of my coins. So put coins here, wallet here, and there we go. So eating out this week, I have nothing in dining. So I know it says munchies, but this is my eating out envelope. And that is going to get stuffed with $40 this week. So that's going to get one $20 bill, one $10 bill, one $5 bill, and five ones, I think. Yeah, so one, one, two, three, four, five, and we'll put this one back. So that is $40 in food, 
20, 30, 35, and 40. Yep. So munchies is done, which is my dining out. Whew. Okay, so munchies is done. Now we're gonna move on to my spending. And my spending did not have, I did not spend anything from my spending category and that is $10 going into rollover for this week at least. And we're gonna put a tenant into spending. Yep, as usual. Okay, so one $10 bill here. And now out and about is my gas envelope. And we have quite a bit of rollover in here. Um, so if you check out my last video uh, for April week number four's check in cash out, you'll know why I have so much in rollover uh, for gas. So I have got 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, and 31 dollars. So that is all going here into rollover and we are going to go ahead and stuff 50 dollars as usual uh, into our gas fund and that is going to be one 20 dollar bill, one 10 dollar bill, two fives, so one two, and ten ones. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So all of these. I don't know why I thought maybe <laughs> there was like 15 ones here. So let's count it out just to make sure. So we've got 20, 30. 35, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, and 50. So 50. This envelope's going to be very chunky. We'll see if it all fits in there. Hopefully it does. So 50 in here. And as always, guys, if you are interested in any of these envelopes, I do have them listed below. Um, they're from like different shops, but I always have them listed. They're all from Etsy pretty much. So Etsy is definitely my kryptonite. Okay, so that is that. We're going to go ahead and put this away. So let's put my spending category here first. Out and about and munchies. Oof, this is looking very chunky. <laughs> and let's go ahead and quickly do my coins for the week. Ooh, speaking of which, I know there's a dollar in here. Very weird, uh, but no. <laughs> Cassius um, went ahead and gave me a dollar. He had rollover too, so, or like he had a random dollar left over. So he said, put that into your $1 savings challenge. So I was like, yes, let's do it. <laughs> so very sweet of him. He literally saves like all of his dollars now. <laughs> um, so we're gonna go ahead and put this. Oop, my stone was stayed in there. Perfect. So this is the change for this week. There we go. I always think that there's like at least half, but now nah, we still haven't hit that halfway mark here in the coins. I get so hopeful. <laughs> so let's go ahead and put this back in here. And we are done with our cash envelopes. We'll go ahead and put my wallet to the side since we don't need it anymore. And we'll get stuff in. So this week, move this here, save some room. There we go. Okay, so for bills this week, we are stuffing $150 into bills and subscriptions since we are starting off brand new this month. Okay. 
so subscri subscriptions is getting 150 so that's 150 right there and that is a that okay now rent is going to get to $200 and that's going to be two $100 bills so that's right there Grabbing more envelopes than I need. So that is that. And that is it for there. Now we're going to move on to stuffing some of our low priority sinking funds. We do put $15 towards that each week. So we are able to stuff three essentially. So let's go ahead and flip to which low priority sinking funds I ended up wanting to stuff this week. So it is going to be car maintenance, pets, and date night. So this should have three fives, which is correct. So we're going to go ahead and get to our Mojo Jojo binder, since that is where car maintenance is. And car maintenance is a relatively new envelope, guys. I had just introduced this last week. So here we go. We're going to put $5 in there. So that is 25 total into car maintenance. And that is it for this binder. So I'm going to go ahead and put this away. Now we're going to move on to pets. And that is going to get $5 this week. It is in our Powerpuff Girls binder. And I'm trying to bulk this back up since I did end up spending out of it. I also need to pull out of it. I forgot to do that in my cash out check in. I don't know why. Maybe because I don't pull from my sinking funds all that often. Um, just because I do kind of want to save up for it still. But I was supposed to take out $23. So let's do 10 15, 20, 21, 22, and 23. So this is going to go back to the bank, guys. Should have done this in my cash out check-in video, but I didn't. Now we're going to pull a five. So I have 10, or 20, 30, and 35 in pets, which is great. Okay, and that is it for this binder. Our last binder that we're going to be stuffing is for date night. Date night's getting some love, guys. So let's see. So our hem binder. I'm going to go ahead and flip back to date night. And date night, let's see how much it's got in there. So we've got 20, 25, 30, and 35. So 35 in date night, which is great. It's adding up quite nicely. I think I definitely want to save up for like, I don't know, I just, find, I want to find, I want to do it like a fun date. A fun date. The usual is the movies, movies and dinner, which I'm totally fine with. It's my jam. It's my comfort zone, but I don't know. I want to do something different so oh let's fix this because I am not gonna like that there we go that's better okay so and we're done with that we're gonna go ahead and put our rollover away but let's actually put our back to the bank money away first oops uh oh knocking things over okay gotta be careful with candles don't want to burn the house down that'd be very bad <laughs> uh, okay so bank 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 oh we also need to do our receipts yeah let's do that we'll do bank first so we're gonna go ahead and put away my $23 that I needed to put back. These are some nice ones, huh? Is there any fives that are like 
not cute. These are, this five's not a, these tens are okay. We're gonna have to take these two fives here and put them back here. Cause I do like the fives are crispier in these ones. So we still got $23 going back to the bank for our cat food expense, our pet expense that we had to pull from one of our sinking funds. So that's that. And this is our rollover for the week. Putting that into a different envelope. Okay. So if you are part of the budgeting community, you probably already know this, but um, if you go ahead and if you guys haven't already, make sure you guys download the Fetch Rewards app. It's an app where you scan your receipts and then once you scan your receipts, they get converted into points and then those points then can, can get converted into gift cards of your choice. So um, hopefully you can use my referral card, uh, refer referral code here. Hopefully it's popping up on the screen. Boop, beep, boop, pop. Um, if you use my code and you download the app and you make you do your first scan, you get 2,000 points. And then I also get 2,000 points. So we both win. It's great. Um, I am currently saving up for probably an Ulta gift card or maybe a restaurant. I'm not sure. I, I had seen like Red Robin on there too and whatnot. So we'll see. I recently went to Red Robin not too long ago. I feel like in the last couple months, so it wasn't too bad. I freaking love their steak fries. They're so good. Okay. <laughs> As I digress. So that's it for the receipts. Now let's go ahead and move on to our rollover. And let's see how much rollover we've accumulated this week. And I am having some trouble, guys, enunciating today. But then again, I feel like I'm always like that. Either I talk really fast and I stumble over my words. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I should just take it slow. <laughs> okay, so rollover this week is getting quite a bit. We are definitely following along in the same train as last month in terms of rollover. So... Let's see. In rollover this week, guys, we have got 10, 20, 25, 30, and 35 dollars. What? 35 dollars. I mean, I, 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 yeah, this month is already looking up, guys. May is going to be a good month. I don't know. Do you guys have anything exciting set up for me? I don't know. Other than Mother's Day, May's kind of like, meh, right? I don't know. What what do, what do you guys look forward to? I mean, it's cherry, cherry season, right? I feel like cherries are definitely in season. I love cherries. Okay, out of all your fruits, guys, what's your favorite fruit? Um, oh, I like everything. <laughs> Pineapple, mango, strawberries, cherries, like, you name it, I probably love it. I'm definitely love fruit. Okay, and in terms of our $1 savings challenge, let's see how much we're putting in here. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven dollars in our rollover. Woo! Seven dollars. Seven dollars going here. Oop, oop. I don't think we've stuffed seven in a while, so that's a big number. Anything above five, I'm like, yes, do it. Okay, these dragon lady nails are stuffing it in. Okay, perfect. Ooh, looking good. So that is it, guys, for this week on our make. May week number one's cash stuffing. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you guys hit that notification bell to see when I upload next. And I will see you guys in a couple days time for our May week number one's check in cash out. We'll see what kind of damage we've done for the week. Hopefully not too bad. Hopefully we can continue on this like 
rollover journey of like excessive rollover because I, I love it. I love it. Okay. Thank you guys again. Bye. Thank you. Bye. -bye.